Hey, pre-approved shoppers. This is Molly at Waterstone Mortgage, and I wanted to check in and um, in light of April Fools, make sure that you are not fooled when it comes to your mortgage financing. A uh, couple of myths that are out there that I get commonly is that renters don't pay taxes or insurance. Well, that's a myth because the property that you live in, if you are a renter, has taxes and insurance. It's not itemized in the rent, but it is paid for through and because of that rent every single month, including a mortgage for the landlord. Myth number two, um, people think they have to put 20% down to get a mortgage. Not true. We have down payment programs that are little as um, zero down, 3% down, 5% down, um, and some varieties in between. And so that down payment, um, just doesn't have to be substantial to get into a home. Uh, home ownership is an investment. That's not necessarily the myth. Um, I just want to point out that home ownership does help accumulate wealth over time with building equity, but it's not a get rich quick scheme. Um, because values can go up or down, over time, the longer you're in a home, then equity has the greater capacity to build and increase. However, it's still providing a, um, a roof over your head. A stock certificate, you can't live in that. How about this myth? You need perfect credit. Uh, also false. Um, credit is an important piece, though it does not have to be perfect. There are lots of loan programs and options that allow for new, slow, or building credit. Um, plus, credit just doesn't scare me. We really understand it and can help you get into the best position to get the best rates possible. I like this one, myth uh, number whatever, you must be a US citizen to purchase a home. Not true. Um, a legal resident also has the ability to purchase real estate. And finally, if you pre-qualify for a mortgage, you definitely get the loan. Ooh, that is not true. And you'll notice that there's all sorts of um, commercials that say apply online it takes eight minutes to get pre-qualified well that just doesn't mean much of anything whatsoever so I love this chart and I'm going to include it um, oftentimes companies will do an online application and that's about as deep as the approval gets if there's additional documents collected which we do this all the time we want to make sure that we have all the supporting evidence so that there's um, no chance of fallout uh, it looks like this. And then we are now taking that even further. It's called a platinum pre-approval where we do a full underwrite upfront on that credit package. If we can make sure that our buyers have the ability to close, then we can avoid um, things that would fall out with additional costs or heartbreak, et cetera. We always wanna make sure our pre-approvals are rock solid, never frivolous. If you have questions in any of those areas, please don't hesitate to call. We love to be on your team. Thank you for your business and uh, have a great day.